Hello, dear viewers. I'm on the second floor of the Heartbeat today. And did you know there is a huge library right here in the middle of the hub? Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Oh, this is great. Dilip is a librarian working there. Now, this is a beautiful library. You know? mm. Now, tell me, uh -huh. why did you become a librarian? It starts with movies. I was a film crazy kid. But after a while, I came to realize that to make a good movie, there's to start with a good story on paper, on print, in a book, almost all the time. So to appreciate movies a lot more, I need to be able to understand the book, right? Mm -hmm. So then I figured there are books, there are movies, there's a grand view, amazing hawker food here mm -hmm. in Badok, right? Iconic hawker centers. So exactly. Yum, yum. So with all of this, with great people as mm -hmm. well, why don't... We all work in the library. But hmm. I always think like librarians, all they do is to put the books back on the shelf. Uh, a lot of people think it's very easy. Just grab a book, I just put it in the air, right? Mm. If I give them a trolley of books, yes. within five minutes, yes. they'll be sweating, they will collapse. Yeah. Would you like hmm. to show me around? Why don't we jump into the rabbit hole? Together? Come on. Yes, come on. Okay, hey, don't go so fast. Okay, we can go slowly. It's so dark. Right. Ooh, I'm so excited. This is the auto-sorting machine that we have okay. here. Okay. Yeah. Oh. So the books get dropped. It comes down? Into the book drop, it slides in. Then yep. it basically organizes itself according to the genre. Genre, yeah. Right, as you can see here. Yes. Okay. yes. So after oh, cool. this happens, yep. all of these books go, go on to... this shelf here where they get organized according to the, to call, the numbers call numbers before they are pushed out and plucked into their perfect spots. From my younger days when everything was manual, technology has transformed many aspects of the library. But how easily can one find a book in this sea of titles? I challenge you now, Belinda. So I'm going to give you a quote. It is an eight-letter eight word, word starting from M. It is in a book that refers to a going book? back home, a colloquial term. Okay, colloquial will be balik kampung. Exactly. Okay. It's a book Eight called balik word. kampung. Balik kampung. Eight letter word starting from M. Okay. Page 89. Oh. Speak to the people, speak to the staff, okay. speak to the books and figure this out. Hello, please help me. Come help me. Uh, where can I look for this book called Balik Kampung? Please help me. Okay. Is it over there? It's a, a local book called Going Home Balik Kampung. B-A-L-E-K Kampung. K-A-M-P-O-N-G. Yes, I got it. Balik Kampung. Yes, so it's then, in Badok Library. See if it's okay. available. As opposed to be 80... Nine, page 89. Let me see. I already see the word ma ma, m a ma, a ma. So it's not this one. Okay, 89, 89, 89, 89. Ah, I got it! Yeah, you see? More memories flooded back. Delete! I found it! It's sunshine, yes. The secret word. Uh huh. It's Memories. Everything you asked me just now, family, friends, humour, the rootedness, the neighbourhood, the kampong spirit of Badok, yeah. it's all inside this book. And I hope the memories are flooding back for you. But most importantly, I hope that our little experience here only gave you good memories. It does. Thank you. This is Belinda Sunshine, checking out on Singapore One.